Welcome back guys, Eli here, and on this video, I'm gonna be talking about five ways that you can use the new software called ChatGPT to help your real estate photography business. And if you haven't heard of this software yet, I highly encourage you to check it out. It launched a little bit over a month ago. It's the fastest program ever to hit over a million users. It did so in just five days, and it is absolutely going to change your business today. And I think when a lot of people hear about new technology, I know this from personal experience, but just watching other people, we don't jump on it very quickly. We could kind of wait until everybody else kind of uses it. And then we're like, oh, okay, we better try this. And that is not the thing to do with this program with ChatGPT. It has so much benefit for your business now. And so I'm hopeful that you watching this video and seeing how I use it will give you a bunch of ideas and make you go try it out. Because again, I think this is absolutely going to change your business. It's already changed mine across all my businesses in the three days we've been using Using it. So I'm going to jump right into my screen into the app and show you how you can use it. So this is chat GPT. In order to get to this part of the software, you're gonna to have to go to chat.openai.com, as you can see right here, and then make an account and it's free. And once you get in here, this is the app and it's super easy to use. So what I'm going to show you basically is some use cases for it. But more importantly, I hope that you just figure out and get your brain moving with some ideas where you can utilize this for yourself. So this basically is a software you can ask it questions, you can ask it to write you stuff, you can ask it a whole number of things. And it's going to use the uh, tons and tons of available data out there with some AI to give you good answers. So the first question that I'm going to ask it, I think will really get your mind moving, which is give me 10 I social media post ideas for my real estate photography business. So a few seconds later, it gave me these 10 options. And I want you to pause this video and read through these because they're pretty good ideas. Normally when you use any sort of app like this in the past, it gives you like two that are good and the rest are just kind of weird and not contextual to your business. But these are some pretty dang good ideas. But here's where it gets even crazier. And really what you have to learn is not how to uh, think of the questions to ask. It's more of how to get the app to give you the ideas and give you what you want. So for example, here, I could take one, and this is something I've learned just playing with it. Um, I could take this one, paste that in here and say, write me a Facebook post on. So pretty good, right? I mean, that's a good post. It's not that personal and it's a little too formal, but I can tell it that I can say, make it slightly less formal and add some jokes. So you can see here that it made it a lot less formal, added some jokes, and we can continue to have it refine this, but I'm going to switch to a completely different topic, which is write me a new year's post for clients of my real estate photography business that I can post on Facebook. Then wrote a pretty good post. Now the thing, like I said earlier, is the real skill here and the way you'll get the most from this app is not by telling it to write just a New Year's post, it's by telling it to write a New Year's post then figuring out how to talk to it in a way that's gonna get you the result you want. So really for anything writing, there's obvious applications, but you can use it to get ideas, you can use it for a ton of other things. So that's a little insight into ChatGPT and the ways you can use it to really assist yourself and make you be able to do things a lot more quickly because your ability to get stuff done is limited by the time it takes you to go from idea to done. And so this software really helps you make that gap shorter. If you have an idea, you can get it done quickly. If you need a Facebook post for your business because it's Tuesday and you post every Tuesday, this will give you 10 ideas for that post. Once you pick one you like, it will write you that post. It will edit that post. It will add jokes in there for you and help you be a lot more productive in your business. So like I said multiple times, do not be the person that waits two years to try this software. The benefit is happening now. Other people are utilizing it now. And that is the whole point of this video to get you to go try chat GPT. So I hope this brought you you some value and I hope that you go crazy coming up with ideas of how you can improve your business and maybe start other businesses using chat GPT. I'll see you guys in the next one.